Aquarius, how you doing, baby? What's good? Oh, hold on, y'all, my little itch. What's good, Aquarius? Welcome back to my channel, Sacred Healing TV. I'm here to do a reading for you all. Um, we're just gonna jump right into it. <laughs> We just finna jump right into it because spirit ain't playing no games and want you to know what's going on and what is coming into your life. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Also check out my description down below. If it don't fit, don't force it. And flip the rose on how it goes for you in your life. First of all, these came out, the Nine of Pentacles and the Hanged Man. So you received some type of clarity. Baby, God showed you something. A fire is, is about to be lit in your life. Something is about to expand, explode. You, your success. Something is changing very fast. Birds could be very significant. Parrots, parakeets. Something about colorful birds. Some of you could be a speaker or you're going to get some type of... Um, gig being a speaker which is going to set the tone for the next few months for you this is what you are supposed to be doing you're supposed to be a speaker i heard a guest speaker whatever you released whatever you just released is what's bringing this in for you i do feel like this mercury retrograde is very very good for you even though I know some, you know, when you hear Mercury grades, it's about stopping, pausing, taking time out to see what's going on. But I feel like during this Mercury retrograde, there is a lot, a lot of change taking place for you, Aquarius. Just make, the, make sure that you read everything carefully. I heard before signing the dotted line. But this is all supposed to be taking place for you. I feel like whatever was holding you back or whoever was holding back from you, this is no longer taking place. Okay. All of this is about to be released to you. Tenfold is what I heard. Look, the fool card. Something is coming in quick. Whatever you took a leap on, it's coming in very, very fast. We also have the king of wands. This could be you. It's a king, but look, if you are feminine, flip the roles. It's a queen, okay? But there is a brand new beginning in your stability that is coming. This is about to bring you to a whole nother level financially. This is something that you pray for. Y'all really went within and asked God to assist you. And I feel like God shed some light on some things. Um, like I said, with this, with this hanged man, which means that you received some type of clarity. You're no longer hanging, okay? You understand the assignment. You could be seeing squirrels. Squirrels are very significant. Look up the spiritual meaning to it, please, because squirrels, owls. I heard insects. But baby, let me tell you something. This heartbreak is changing into something that is going to grow. You see they holding hands? Yeah, this is going to grow. You know your worth. You're standing up for yourself. You went through this transformation. You're going to be celebrated. You are about to be celebrated. You are very confident. You are going after what it is because God already showed you. The Hierophant, uh, you are very spiritual. You are in tune. You know what you want. You're not letting nothing hold you back. Look, you made your choice to release the past and go towards the future. You don't know what the future holds, but guess what? You see this boat right here? You finna jump on that thing. And you got the world in your hand. I heard the war the world is your oyster. Maybe God gave you a clear path. A clear path. So what's good? This tower, the storm, this is what's going on in other people's lives. 
this is what's going on in their lives. A lot of people are feeling defeated at this time. They feel like tower after tower after tower. But on the other hand, this is you with option after option after option. You're getting your wish fulfillment. The wheel of fortune has turned. The karmic tables have turned. It is done. It is judgment time. We have the emperor and the queen of pentacles. So this could be you and your boss energy. But I'm also getting that somebody could view you as this queen of pentacles. You're very stable. You're very fertile. Whatever you touch grows. As you see these flowers, everything around her is growing. And somebody's going to come offer you something. Period. I feel like this person could have been getting away with something. Holding back. I'm not getting anything as far as this person was trying to be sneaky and deceptive towards you. Like they were trying to steal your inheritance is what I heard. I don't believe that. I feel like this person is manifesting. <laughs> they are finding the strength to come towards you because they see you as their wish fulfillment. All right. This person is very emotionally balanced. They see you as everything. They see you as the stability. They want to come home to you every night. This person, I'm getting a lot of emotions right now. This is what this person is about to come in and explain to you with this moon card. This is what was hidden. All right. This person did have to go through some type of transformation before coming towards you, and they did it. Now they're planting their seeds, and they finna come with this communication. Um, I also saw these wands and something else. If you know, you know. <laughs> Baby, I better use protection if you don't want. <laughs> if you don't want no children. But they view you as a star, as the nine of pentacles, or the nine of pentacles. The Nine of Cups. They want you. They've been in hermit thinking about this. Here they come with this world. Y'all supposed to be clarifying these other cards. And I, I didn't look at all these cards and it came out. Okay, so we're not going to make this long Aquarius. But I just want to let y'all know. This is the current energy surrounding you. You better make up your mind. Because this person is here. You're, you are already connecting to this, this person, a lot of you. Or when you actually meet this person, things are going to take off very fast. Very fast. Movement choices and decisions. I feel like... I did a reading the other day. I think it was Divine Feminine. So some of you could be Divine Feminine watching this. Um, a lot of doors are being opened to you. I feel like doors of opportunity doors that are going to grow oh i'm seeing whatever seeds that you plant growing i'm seeing marriage on the table i'm seeing money i'm seeing houses i'm seeing babies i'm seeing whatever it is that you want you're going to get it you see how they're looking at each other this is deep this is deep y'all because you stood the test you passed you cleared out something. This is why you're being given this key. God is trusting you with this key because of the work, because you stood your ground, because you followed spirit. You stood all the test. And you were strong, baby. You moved that mountain. You are the mountain. <laughs> Nothing broke you. You stood. There's a song by Monica called Still Standing. Go listen to that, baby. Go listen to it. Listen. I asked Spirit, what, what do you want Aquarius to focus on? You know what they said. Continue to focus on your money and your love life. Because it's going to continue to blossom. Look, 
door to romance in your union. <laughs> yeah. You are finna be so blessed that I feel overwhelmed right now because I know that's how you're going to feel in that moment because it's so much changing and and a lot of these things are taking you by surprise because it's things that you didn't even some of the things you forgot about that you prayed about and it's coming to pass now and some things you prayed about recently and it's like like that is happening all of this is over financial constraints Look, you see the chain? Chained to your circumstances is changing. No more living paycheck to paycheck. Because God is giving you this brand new beginning. You see that dolphin? Go look up the dolphin. Pay attention to every detail spirit is showing you right now. Because it has meaning. No more juggling. No more. Christening. Somebody could be christening their child. Somebody's name could be Kristen. Christmas. Could be significant to somebody but this is balance y'all there is something that took a while to get here <laughs> this is not a pinnacle came out again but this is about to make you so happy it's your time to celebrate you're coming out of this energy of being disappointed of carrying the load by yourself with nobody to help you. Nobody. You see that? Dropping sticks. Overwhelmed, overworked, burdened, too much on your plate. Feeling trapped like you can't move, like you invested in something bad. But you stood still and you continued to work. You persevered. Oh my gosh. I feel like crying. Whew. This could be y'all right now. But you continue to work. You continue to build. You continue to build. All right. You felt like this wasn't coming in for you. Having a lot of anxiety and fear. What else, Devon? You're no longer in your head. This came out again. You are in your spiritual calling now. Y'all, this tower came out again. Oh, there's an offer coming your way. There is an offer coming your way. You're going to have to make some type of decision. You could have people around you trying to gaslight you. People who weren't ready for you. All right. But baby, you're sacred. Always remember that. You're not for everybody. You release these people. pressure you're applying pressure <laughs> your glow up is apply is is like putting a lot of pressure on these people and i feel like it's because they slept on you cuz they was fake they was fake but baby endings bring new beginnings all right Somebody could be coming in trying to tell you that they care about you. All they do is think about you. They had a lot on their plate. I, I hear excuses. That's all I hear is excuses. 
I hear excuses. This could be a twin flame for some of you. Karmic soulmate for some of you. Somebody who had a lot of options. This is um, a karmic emperor. But um, that's all I have for y'all, Aquarius. Y'all got a real emperor coming in. Yeah. That's all I have for y'all, Aquarius. Thanks so much for tuning in. Peace.